A total of 330 children and adults attended the school play. There were 21 times as many children in attendance as there were adults. The situation is modeled by the given system of equations, where A represents the number of adults and C represents the number of children. It says there were 21 times as many children in attendance as adults. So C, the number of children, is equal to 21A, 21 times the number of adults. It also says a total of 330 children and adults attended the play. So A plus C, the adults plus the children, and that equals 330. So we have that system of equations to work with. We're going to take that second equation and solve that for A. Because if we take that second equation and solve for A, you can then substitute into the top equation. And then we'll be able to solve for C because C really is what we're looking for. We want to find the number of children that attended this play. So take that second equation, again, solve for A, subtract C from each side. When you do that, you get A equals negative C plus 330. Now we're going to take that negative C plus 330 because that's what A is equal to and substitute that in for A into the top equation. And then we'll be able to solve for C. So take out that A in that top equation and replace it with this negative C plus 330. So we're replacing the A with the negative C plus 330. So you have C equals 21 times negative C plus 330. Use the distributive property with that 21. Take 21 times negative C, that is negative 21C. And 21 times 330, that is 6,930. Get the C's to one side, so add 21C to each side. When you do that, you get 22C is equal to that 6,930. And then finally, divide each side by 22. If you divide 6,930 by 22, that is 315. So the number of children that attended the play is 315.